good morning students today we are going to take our questions from the chapter properties of triangle so let's start with some basic questions in last class we studied about some properties of triangle in which there is a property for checking of the triangle also when we need to check a triangle with the help of its angle we just need to add all three angles and their sum must be equals to 180 so on that property only your first question resides your first property is uh, first question is that state whether the angles are forming a triangle okay that is the symbol of a triangle so in this first part you have 30 degree 60 degree and 90 degree three angles are given to you now you just need to check for the triangle so for checking the triangle you need to add all these three angles together when you add all these three angles together their sum is equals to 180 degree as we know angle sum property angle sum property of triangle is 180 degree so it is a triangle that is your first part from first question uh, we can take one more um, so we can take third part too that is 60 degree 60 degree and 50 degree as we see their sum is equals to 170 degree and uh, we can say it is not equals to 180 degree that is the sum of triangle right is not equals to 180 degree so it is not forming a triangle so that is all from this topic we can move towards our next topic <coughs> now in question number two if the angles of a triangle are equal find its angles there is a condition given to you if the angles of triangle are equal you need to find all the angles uh, there are a total of three angles so we can let the angles be equal uh, be x degree right and there are a total of three angles so we can add those three and sum of all the three angles as I stated in your first question also is equals to 180 degree by the property of angles and property of triangle when you add all these three x you will get 3x equals to 180 then you can divide 180 by 3 so that you will get an angle of 60 degree so all the three angles of this triangle are equal so we can say all the three angles of this triangle are equals to 60 degree so all the angles of this triangle is equals to here yeah, are 180 degree r 180 degree. sorry one uh, r 60 degree so now there are some questions uh, that is third and four similar type of question we will take one of them uh, we can take fourth one for the fourth question you are given that in a triangle pqr in a triangle pqr angle p is equals to 60 degree and angle q is equals to angle r you need to find angle r so you are provided with some information that is uh, 
angle P is equals to 60 degree. That is your solution starting from here. Angle P is equals to 60 degree. Also, angle Q is equals to angle R. We can say that they can be taken as X. Let that angle Q and angle R be X. We also know that all the sum of all three angles is equals to 180 degrees. So, angle P, angle Q and angle R equals to 180 degree. Angle P is 60 degree. These both are taken as X. So, 2x plus 60 will be equals to 180. 60 will move to right hand side and we will get 2x equals to 180 minus 60. 2x will come equals to 120 degree. Now, you can divide 120 by 2. You will get 60 degree as the value of x. We also know that value of x is equal to equals to the value of Q and R. So, value of Q and angle R is 60 degree. Okay. That is your fourth question. So, that is all in this video. We will go through some figure questions. Question number 5 and 6 and 7 in our next video. Thank you.